The Breaks Interstate Park will be hosting the 72nd Annual Tri-State Gospel Singing Festival September 3rd through the 5th. The concert will feature over 25 artists and bands performing a wide variety of music over the three-day show. So the, the Gospel Singing is, is the longest running event that the park has on, it, on its books and, uh, and it actually predates when the park was founded back in 1954. And, and it's really kind of interesting because there, there were people using this area prior to it being established as, as the Breaks Interstate Park. And uh, they would use it for church services, they would use it for weddings, they would use it for events like the gospel scene. And it was those very people who basically fell in love with the area, started using the area, that eventually ended up to it being established as the Breaks Interstate Park. My name is Aaron Crum, Chief Medical Officer at Pikeville Medical Center. The Heart and Vascular Institute, it's really an incredible program. Made incredible because of the providers, because of the technology, and because of the staff. Uh, we've truly become the leading provider of heart and vascular services in Eastern Kentucky. And in fact, what we do compares to anywhere in the nation. Pikeville Medical Center, when it comes to your heart, place your care in our hands. All facilities at the Breaks Interstate Park will also be open, including the water park, zip lining, paddle boats, and food vendors. The festival has been attended by people from all over the country, with some attending for over 50 years. We have some folks that's been coming here for 60 years, some of them 70 years, that comes every year. Uh, actually, there's a lady going to be here this year. It's, this is her 50th year here. Uh, but we're starting to see like uh, their children and grandchildren in the 30s and 40s and something like that bringing their kids back to experience what happens here in the park on Labor Day weekend because a lot of, like my children, they grew up uh, 29 years. They, they come up here, they all did. And, uh, and my daughter's actually coming back this weekend to come in because of the singing here. So yeah, it's just, it's, it just reaches out to, and we have people coming from I mean, probably 10 to 12 different states. At least, yeah. yeah, yeah. Seating is limited and it is recommended to bring a lawn chair. The festival is free to attend. However, the park has a $3 admittance fee. For more information and to view the lineup, visit Breaks Interstate Park on Facebook. For Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.